Hello. I'm here with Stuckman. We're here on a flick trip to Best Buy. He needed to pick up uh, Deepwater Horizon. Hey, what are you doing? Is this an oil rig or something? Is it going to explode? And then the accountant. I love the accountant. Yes. I have the Blu-ray. Uh, it's still in the cellophane. I got it a few weeks ago. I don't have the 4K though. But then again, I don't own a 4K TV, so I don't need it. And Jerry Maguire. The t he, this guy is he's a little bit gay for Tom Cruise. I get it. There's nothing wrong with that. I like Tom Cruise. I mean, I you told me one time you took a picture of Tom Cruise from Mission Impossible 3 to a, uh, a hair place and you said, make me look like that. <laughs> <laughs> and they really fucked it up, too. You know, I have a story. When I was in uh, fifth grade, I took a picture of George Clooney to the hair place and I said, cut my hair like that. Really? And, and then when I was done, she's like, don't forget your picture of George. And I, and I took, yeah. Was so. it George Clooney from Batman and Robin? No, it was George Clooney from like One Fine Day or something. Oh, I, I, the ER. Yeah, era. yeah, it was a classy George Clooney. Yeah, so. yeah. Okay, how much do you think this is right here? I was going to say, no, don't do it. But what what? We got? what is this? What's uh, $10,000. Oh, it's only ten thousand yeah. dollars. I'll buy two of them. Uh, is this even OLED? Here's the thing I learned about getting the TVs like this at Best Buy. Yeah. They look amazing in the store. Sure. Because there's a billion lights on. Yeah, yeah. You take them home. You put it in your your office or whatever, and you turn you turn the lights off. You see the black levels, and and the thing is, all these TVs, like if you look in the corners, you can see lights leaking through. Yes. Yeah, I've I've, t I've actually bought a lot of TVs in my life, and I've returned a lot of TVs the next day. Yeah, I think you and I are very similar where we're very particular about the image. Well, we're anal retentive assholes with picture quality, <laughs> but I think that's, that well, you should be. If you're going to pay a thousand, couple thousand dollars for a TV, it's got to be perfect. Every pixel should count. Yeah. This is pretty much what I have, except mine's curved and this is flat. Mine's curved too. I'm not talking about the TV. Yeah, I, uh, <laughs> dude, okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let you guys know something right now. Okay, so I got to Stuckman's house yesterday. Yep. We're watching movies on his, like, 65-inch OLED 4K curved TV, super duper ultimate edition that makes everything in 3D I and also gives you a back massage. Uh, and I want it now. Like, I, yeah. like I, I talked myself out of 4K for a long time, but now after watching it it's amazing. and watching the 3D of Star Wars Episode Seven yesterday, I need it and I want it. So I think that's the next purchase for me. Um, this current model, though, here's the problem. <laughs> yeah, fuck that. Well, uh, I got mine on sale. I know. See, yeah. that's the thing. And that mine same... Was, I think, 28. 28. See, that's, that's, that's reasonable. I feel like in another six months, it'll be like two. Yeah. Two grand. But still, that's a... Uh, and that one's not even curved. No. Do you like the curve? Do you prefer yeah, the curve? Yeah, it's supposed to be more relaxing to your eye. Really? I understand. There's only one left. <laughs> No, there's not only one left. They just got one. Yeah, there's only one to and no begin one, with. And for the next nine months, that same copy will be there. No one will buy it. I hope so. Too. But I feel like you kind of want it. I know. <laughs> just a little bit. I'm going to come back every week and check to see if that's there, and it'll, it'll become my friend. Doesn't a little part of you want to take that one copy of Max Steel right down there and just hide it somewhere in obscurity so no one can ever find it, and no one ever has to go through the agonizing pain of watching it or accidentally <laughs> so buying it's, it? it's just for me. This Best Buy is uh, probably one of the most dead Best Buys I've ever been in, ever. Really? Uh, yeah, You're there's... Like not a lot of people. Not a lot of people, and I like the way it's laid out, because yeah. you have a lot of dead space, and no one bothers you. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Like, look over here. We could just go over there and hang out all day. No one would bother us. All right, so tonight we're actually going to see uh, the <laughs> upcoming classic horror film that will define a decade. Uh, it's a... Uh, Bye-bye, man. Um, don't say it, Chris. Don't, don't even think it. Name. Don't no, think it. He'll get you. Uh, so we're going to see that, review that. We'll do a collab uh, review. That, that'll be on your channel. Yes. Uh, and, uh, yeah, I'm, I, but, you know, the best thing is I'm really looking forward to seeing this. I am actually, too. I, you know, there's something about January that's it's shit. Yes. But it's, like, a little bit refreshing after, like, a month of Oscar movies. Yes. To just watch disposable garbage. Just to, like, let your brain leak out of your ear and uh, just enjoy I, I'm, but here's the problem with this movie if they actually try and it just doesn't succeed on yeah. any level I'm just going to be bored Yeah. but if, but if they, they tried so hard <laughs> that they just didn't know what they were doing and it's so shitty then it's going to be a phenomenal movie Yeah. that's what I need and that's what I want no I wouldn't I, I would if she was hot
All right, guys, so we're in the car. I I like the beep sound. It's okay. Uh, so we, we're in the car now. It's a shitty, miserable, rainy day in Ohio. Uh, we got some snacks, some peanut M&Ms, yes. licorice, and a uh, Pepsi Zero. Coke Zero. Coke Zero. You correct, don't ever correct me again, Chris. Don't You're you? in my car, bitch! Fine. That's fine. <laughs> I will slap you in the tits with this licorice. Um, you don't like licorice, do you? It's okay. It's all right. I just, um... I specifically remember what you told me when I first met you three years, four or five years ago. You told me, I don't like to eat fruity snacks. I'm not a big fan yeah. of uh, sour fruit snacks. Okay. I like, like, um, I really like gummy bears, and I like, uh, like, Jolly Ranchers are good. Um, but I, I'm not a big fan of your all-time favorite thing, so Sour Patch Kids. You don't like Sour Patch Kids? No. Give me your hand. Just give me your hand. <laughs> that's, for, that's for blowing up my wife's house, and this is for hitting my daughter in the eye. By the way, he put back Jerry Maguire. I watched him do it. I have it already. It's it's like does anyone? I, I don't need the new thing. It's Jerry Maguire. I have the Blu-ray. What a yeah! You got to see that in 4K restoration. <laughs> <laughs> You want to get in? I'll push you. Sometimes the stuff you find in like, you know, like the young kids' shirt sizes are yeah. cooler than some of the adult sizes. Like children's clothes, you, you want to wear them. Yeah, like no, I I'm, do. You put I no. Sound like, that. <laughs> like look at the abdomen on on Batman that's right here. Cool. Like if that was an adult size shirt, I, I would like buy this it. Quite a bit. Yeah, that, that's cool. That's a cool design. I like this. The pixelated Star Wars. Yeah. I agree. They actually that do have Spidey kept. Uh, cap crossover is cool. So, Youths of America, enjoys your, enjoy your bone structure while you can. Yeah, right. So right, you can right. buy the cool t-shirts at Walmart. So if you're wondering where people buy their poster frames, especially Stuckman and myself, well, Walmart is the place. Walmart Target. They're affordable, but you, you do get what you pay for, but it's good enough. Alright, so we came here to get a tripod. Yes. Uh, we want to do uh, a, a tri-cast, as they call it, the biz. Multi-cam video. I call it a tri-cast. Okay. Tri-cast feels good. We're going to do uh, a video so we need to get more a tripod. than one angle. Yeah, three yes, angles. We're going to get a tripod, John. We're going to get the tripod. Are. Guess what? what? Walmart doesn't close. There's no. no rush. Yeah, but after a certain time <laughs> in Walmart, you the, the, the zombies, the hoarders of the consumers come out. Yeah. And I don't want to be... And then they start cleaning the floors of bleach. Yeah. And they start yeah. roping everything off. Yeah, it's the best time of day. No, you can't go anywhere. <laughs> I can't even get a loaf of bread. That doesn't even look like Emma Stone. It really doesn't even look like the air brushed the shit out of her face. Huh. Hang on. Hey, Emma, what are you doing over there? Hey, come here. Hey, that doesn't look like you. Hey, come here. <laughs> I'm a wobba, okay. Where's the, where the tripods at? <laughs> you realize that this motherfucker crashed a fucking plane and lived. I did, well, he's Han Solo. If he can fly the Millennium Falcon, I imagine he could crash a plane and live. You want a pair of cool shoes, some and ones? I do not want Walmart shoes. I do. Those Batman ones right there look pretty good. Walmart shoes fall apart very quickly. Do they? Oh, yes. I don't know That's about one it. one of the few things that I really genuinely go overboard with in regards to like quality is I look for really good shoes really? and I don't buy a new pair for like two years. I just bought these three days ago. They're red. What do you think about them? They're noticeable. <laughs> they Red is my power color. <laughs> well, now I want a blankie. Here, take this Batman blankie. Okay, good. Because we are sacrificial lambs about to be put into the slaughter. Yeah. We're going to watch that. It's not even, it's not just mental, pre it's, it's spiritual preparation. It is spiritual. <laughs> Looking at those terribly CGI'd Wolverine claws that look like from 1993 um I, I anyway you guys can watch that video that's coming uh, a month or two on his channel yeah, february yeah so look out for that uh, hilariosity review but you know what chris i wanted to calm down and i just wanted to talk to you i just mm. wanted a conversation about life liberty and justice mm. and i want to know what makes you tick people always ask this question it's gonna sound weird when i first how did we come to be chris how did how did we Bond, like two well, ships in the night. I was at a bar, <laughs> yeah. and uh, you were dancing. I was dancing. Yeah, and I came in. And what happened was, I came down off the pole, 
Yeah, you did. And, you know, I bent down. Covered in glitter. Yeah, covered in and glitter. Oil. And Sweat and, and, and mm -hmm. glistening, glistening sweat. I came off the, the stage, yeah. and there was this these two eyeballs in the darkness. It's getting very erotic. That were just staring at me yeah. in, in this dark part of the bar. And as I was taking off my assless chaps. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. These eyeballs got very excited to see me, and I looked, and it was this this little alien boy, this little addicted to heroin, this thin, like gangly alien boy who looks like I do now. Yes, but shorter. Yes. Yeah. And he said, "Hello, my name is the Flick Pick." I refer to myself in third person. Yes, always. and I said, "Hello, my name is Quick Movie Reviews." <laughs> That's not you. <laughs> and then you threw. Uh, some dollar bills at me. Crinkly dollar bills. Yes. And, yeah. and I proceeded to dance uh, naked for you before we finally decided that we should be friends. Yeah. And that's the truth. That's the truth. And that's not even a joke. It's not for comedic effect. No. That is the truth. That's absolutely what happened. And we both coincidentally found out later that we just both made YouTube videos. Yeah. Beyond this, beyond when I was a stripper at a bar. You still have that as a side gig. Yeah, so I mean, it's easy. If you guys easy. go to Platinum Plus in Akron, Ohio, yeah. you might find Chris on a Tuesday night. When you can dance like Michael Jackson, it's an easy gig. It really is. You know, they just hire you instantly. It really is. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, essentially, I think I was at the library, yeah. actually. You're at the library? I think okay. so. I think I actually was at the library. And um, I was just looking at YouTube videos, yeah. and I came across... You and and you were talking about Broken Arrow yeah, and Heartbreak a Ridge, a Clint Eastwood film and a Christian Slater film. Yeah, yeah, a badass Clint Eastwood movie. And, and I, I had just seen Heartbreak Ridge. Okay. And I went, oh, someone else is talking about that. And then you said Broken Arrow, and I was like, that's a guilty pleasure of mine. So I started watching more of your videos and ended up sending you a YouTube message. I was yeah. like, hey... Your videos are cool, and then we just started chatting from there. Yeah, we started talking about things. I think I made a YouTube banner for you at one point. You did. You made a really yeah. badass YouTube banner yeah. for me. Um, I missed that. I, I, I want to go back and look at that. Anyway, um, it had like Luke Skywalker on the side and some Indiana Jones yeah, stuff. Yeah, it was the, really cool. Yeah, that was a long time ago, and the first time we ever collabed, I will never forget it, the first ever video that we collabed on, do you remember? Is it what to expect when you're expecting? I was hoping that you would forget so I could lie, and at least, <laughs> at least have some dignity as a man and say it was Battleship. Yeah, that was the other one we did. That was, so two awful videos, and then we eventually did Dark Knight uh, Rises. Rises. Yeah, and I, a ton of other things. Dude, so many times, I like, uh, good times. Six years have flown by. So anyway, guys, we're going to unfortunately watch this now. And uh, we're going to shoot a review, but it's going to be painstaking. But then uh, hopefully we laugh. Yeah. Uh, thank God that they uh, gave Ryan Reynolds another chance for Deadpool. Yeah, really. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks, Chris. Check out Chris's channel. Link down below. You guys already know who he is. But if you don't, link down below. And we'll see you guys next time.